Hello guys, this is uh, Glenn. And I just wanted to show you how I solved the input output issues of putting the inputs and outputs of the rack in an S16 in a small rack, very small. And also, as I go around the front, I would like to show you Dave's mixing station on an HP 20, Slate 21 Pro that just came today. On top of the same rack, it's in the front. You can get the old XLRs, ins and outs. Oops, sorry about that. Uh, ins and outs, plus the power. You can see the S's back in there pretty far. But, you know, you don't need to really see that side very much. The rack is here. Slate 21 is here. We have control. All right. And to switch back and forth between here and a regular PC, we have control over this is a Reaper on the same screen. Touch control too. Touch control trolling a PC. Which will probably end up being a NUC in the rack quad core. Alright. Back to Android on the same display. I did lay out a custom thing showing that you can have uh, 12 normal channels here. I've got some aux, got the main house, I got a DCA there. Hoping for 24 out of this, but I couldn't quite get it to do 24. Uh, I did pay for the paid version, but I think this is not the paid version. I'll have to play with that. Thank you. Have a good day.